hey 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 welcome back to my channel today i'm bringing to you the cheetah cake and don't worry i am not going to use a cheetah in this recipe but the cake just looks like a cheetah without wasting time let's just get started i've got here six medium sized eggs i'll get a bowl and come in with the egg yolks I have 200 grams of butter. I'll just melt it up in the microwave. I'll drop in some vanilla essence. I'll add the melted butter to the egg yolks. With the help of my spoon, I'll mix it up. Next, I'll come in with about four tablespoons full of full cream milk. And I'll continue mixing. I'll come in with about a half teaspoon of powdered cinnamon. I'll now come in with my cake flour. I'll be using 200 grams. I'll drop in 15 grams of baking powder. Now I'll get my egg white and with the help of a mixer, I'll whip it up till it turns fluffy. While it's whipping, I'll be adding my sugar in bed. I'll use about 150 grams. So as you can see, it's all done and fluffy. I will get my flour mixture and come in with my egg white. Now to get the cheetah effect, I will drop in some chocolate chips. I'll mix it up to distribute it evenly. I'll get my greased baking pan and I'll pour the cake mixture into it. I'll put it in a preheated oven of about 150 degrees Celsius. I'll be baking this for about 30 minutes. So after baking it for 30 minutes, this is what we have here. It is ready. Let's just go ahead and cut a piece. And ladies and gentlemen, our cheetah cake is ready. This certainly looks like the fur of a cheetah. And you definitely need this on your breakfast table. I hope you did enjoy this and I hope you are going to give it a try. If you do, let me know how it comes out for you. You can send me pictures if you want to. If you've not subscribed, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to share this with family and friends and don't forget to leave me that big fat thumbs up. Until next time, I am going to see you again with another nice and interesting one. Bye bye! I must say my face feels softer and smoother. Okay guys, so that is it. I hope I did help you and I hope you are going to give this a try. If you do, let me know how it comes out for you. If you've not subscribed, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to share this with family and friends and don't forget to leave me that big fat thumbs up. Until next time, I am going to see you again with another nice and interesting one. Bye bye!